Hey guys, this is a quick video uh, in regards to the update 8.0. If you are having frame rate drops, video lags, uh, any sort of lags that's not internet related, more of a video kind of lag, uh, the first thing you want to try, uh, which worked for me, is to disable G Sync. So uh, that's what I found it caused me a lot of problems. So. Um, as you can see, I have a mindset 120 frames per second. Uh, on this load screen, usually it's a little bit lower, but basically, um, you want to get to this perfectly smooth, stable 120 hertz, uh, 120 uh, frame per second, right? So uh, let me start. Um, and basically, you should hold at a constant frame per second instead of having something like this, right? Where it constantly drops a little bit and actually gets very very uh, very bad game uh, experience if you have tiny little drops like this uh, so you want it is stable so to stabilize it I found to disable G-Sync in my uh, in my monitor uh, settings as well as uh, in here make sure you go to here and just, just disable G-Sync you can set the refresh rates to whatever you want um, but uh, 120 hertz, 124, as much as your monitor can support, but make sure you disable G-Sync because that's what it fixed for me. Uh, so hopefully that helps you too. Uh, now the other thing that people were saying that might have helped them is go to manage 3D settings uh, and then just make sure you have a program setting and make sure you have um, the tank, uh, the World of Tanks selected and you, you click restore and it should restore all the settings. Uh, just use all basic default settings. You should be okay there. Uh, if something got changed, that's where people were causing problems. Um, but then also power management mode. I think some people are saying that switching this to performance or maximum performance would work. Uh, me personally, I don't need it. All I need to do is turn off the freaking G-Sync and once I turn off the G-Sync, it stabilizes just like that. I play the game right there at 120 hertz and boom.